Yo, 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 it's your boy Box MVP, and we back again with another one. It's late night, man. I'm at the group home. I decided to start the video here since y'all don't ever see me at work. I'm at the group home right now. I'm actually up here doing the fun shit, which is scheduling. So I'm doing the books right now. I'm going over all my employees' hours, but um, tomorrow I got to go up to the shop and take some pieces to the Box Chevy up there. <laughs> Excuse me, so we're going to go ahead and handle that, but I was going to show y'all around here real quick. Let y'all see what it's looking like. Oh, as y'all can see, that's the books. That's my um, planner right there. I'm doing all the hours and stuff. Going over and making sure everything is good to go. And um, as y'all can see up here, exit sign. Show y'all my certificates and shit. But it ain't nothing but a house. That's what the group home is, just a house. And I actually brought some work with me to work. Look what I brought, some wrapping paper. It's dark right here. Brought some wrapping paper. And some uh, the other tail light. I already did the other tail light. I gotta do that one now. So I don't even be watching TV, but y'all see certificates, purposeful living, three bedrooms. Got three different clients in here. This room is occupied. Room one, room two is occupied. Room three, and just a little restroom. But you know, just it's that med cabinet right here fire escape plan just little stuff you know just house rules and responsibilities just little shit exercise over the door visitor sign in sheets over there resident sign in sheet then over here we got the log for and then you see what it do the third shift duties clean the fridge all that stuff bathroom see how that shit go exercise over the back door just the employee log in like I said, it's just a little house, man. It's just one of them, though. So, got all the emergency numbers over here. Right over here, got all the emergency numbers. So, every, this this would pay for these box Chevys, man. This was paying for these box Chevys, man. So, y'all stay tuned. If you don't work, you don't eat. But I'll see y'all in the morning, man. Let's go. Well, as y'all can see, man, we finna go... Give y'all that update on the box Chevy. Everybody been asked. In Rock Point, eight miles. Take a slight left turn onto West Lisbon seat. Avenue. They need to get dropped off out there anyway. So we got a reason to go out there. So everybody been looking for an update on the box. I'm going to go out there. He have made a little more progress. So we're going to go out there and see what's cracking. And um, I'm going to run at the car wash right now. I'm going to run through this scrubber dirt right quick and give me a quick wash. And then uh, I'm going to shoot out there. So y'all stay tuned. And if you're new to the channel, man, make sure y'all hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit the like button. And if you want to, comment down below, man. We always going to have some lift footage, y'all. See, your boy been trying to get back active, man. You know what I'm saying? I've been trying to get back on my daily posting, or at least every other day, if not every day. You know what I mean? So, uh, I got a lot of people. And I don't be realizing, too, I got so many people who look forward to seeing my videos. But I understand, because it's, it's channels like that that... Uh, I look forward to seeing their videos and I'm checking their page religiously, you know what I'm saying? See if they done posted something new just because I like their content. And I don't like content based off how many subscribers you got. I see people with 100 subscribers that I like their page. There's people with 8,000 I like their page. So it ain't about how many subscribers you got. It's just about your content. If it's car content, I like it, you know what I'm saying? But it got to be some substance to it. But if you're making progress and you're doing shit, I like watching channel, see how it's going or whatever. But, uh... Y'all probably can't hear me that good in this car wash, but I'm going to go ahead and uh, I'm going to drive this car off, and then we're going to shoot out here to the uh, paint shop, man, and check on the old land down. So y'all stay tuned, and I'm going to cut y'all back on when we get there, man. Let's go. right now uh because they, they're getting ready to paint it it's been primer it's ready to spray so y'all can see all the body work is complete on it so it's ready to spray hold this right here all the body work is complete so it's ready to spray y'all 
We got the block sand and everything. Put the rear clip on. Yeah, I know I got all the trim. So they got the the rear clip on here. Be ready to spray. These are the pieces I bought, the ones that's right here. Those are the pieces that go there. So it's hot as hell in here too. This is the baker. This way they put it after they, after they paint it. Yeah. And this side right here where it had the hole in the rocker. You see they got the hole squared away down there. They got it looking good. Got it looking good. So the bumper fillers, like I said, those are two pieces that I'm dropping off today. And they get them sprayed. I got new rallies and everything for it. It's looking good. So that's pretty much it for now, y'all. Y'all will see it when it's painted. It's maybe another week or so, it'll be sprayed. So y'all stay tuned. Oh yeah, they got it smooth as a baby's ass too, baby. Yeah. So y'all stay tuned, man. Let me holler at him and I'm gonna get out of here. So as y'all see, it really wasn't much to look at. Just the body work done. They got it, they got it final, they done blocked it and everything, so it's ready to paint now. So, and it's back there in the back. When they get it all the way in the back, that's when it's time to paint. So I dropped off them last little couple pieces. So all we gotta do is basically just wait on the uh call and let me know it's painted, man. 28s is standard on the box Chevy, man. 28s is the standard, you know what I mean? So ain't no way around that. That's that's just the standard size. I think 26s look decent, but 28s at the least for me, man. For the on the box Chevy. That's just that's how I look at it. You know what I'm saying? 30s, I think it's pushing it a little bit, but you can get away with them. But I think 28s at least, just to make it look good. But y'all let me know what y'all think about. Because I'm debating if I'm going to do another 7 inch lip in the rear or I'm going to do a um, 9 inch lip. I'm debating. I think I'm going to do 9 inch this time because I did a 7 inch the last time. I'm thinking about doing a 9 inch too. Get in the comment section. Let me know what y'all think about the box. I think it's looking damn good. And um, yeah, we're going to get it cracking, man. So y'all stay tuned and I'm going to catch y'all in a minute. Peace.